Hello everyone, and welcome to a new Engines of the North America video. Today, we will be talking about our first modern 21st century 6-axle locomotive, the EMD SD70 ACE. The SD70 ACE made its debut in 2005. The SD70 was first catalogued nearly 30 years ago, however, EMD back in the 90s wasn't able to regain their top spot as the number one locomotive manufacturer from GE. On the other hand, the various SD70 designs would eventually become very successful and many variants such as the SD70 Mac are still in service today. The SD in SD70 ACE means special duty. The 70 denotes the model series. The AC means it has AC traction motors and the E means the units are eco-friendly. Each unit has a 710G3C-ES 16 cylinder engine and run on a C-C wheel arrangement. They had a top speed of 70 miles per hour, had a tractive effort of 191,000 pounds and weighed in at 408,000 pounds. They measured in at 74 feet 3 inches and they came equipped with a Nathan K5LA horn. Over 1,400 EMD SD70 ACEs have been built since production began in 2005. With the exception of Canadian National, every North American Class 1 and even a few Class 2s run the SD70 ACE. These include, but are not limited to, the Montana Rail Link, CSX, Norfolk Southern, and Union Pacific. The latter two Class 1s would pay homage to railroads they merged with, such as the Wabash, New Jersey Central, and Penn Central for NS. For Union Pacific, they would pay homage to their mergers with the Western Pacific, Chicago Northwestern, and the Missouri Pacific. In addition, UP 4141 was numbered in honor of George Herbert Walker Bush in 2005 and went on to pull his funeral train in 2018. As of this recording, Union Pacific will be gutting the engine and will be placing it on static display at the Texas A&M College campus in College Station, Texas. More recently, BNSF would also get a heritage unit of its own relatively recently, as of this recording. However, their heritage unit is an ES44 AC as opposed to an SD70 ACE and will be shown in a future video. The railroad with the most SD70 ACEs is the BNSF with a grand total of 450 units. Union Pacific comes in second with just 25 units less than BNSF. Kansas City Southern is in third with 115 units. The SD70 ACE continues to be a steady workhorse for the North American market. EMD's latest model, which is a Tier 4, seems to continue the success of the previous SD70 models. However, said Tier 4 models have had teething troubles and Union Pacific has had to put those units into storage. Being that the units are still relatively new and only being succeeded by newer models of the same unit, none are currently preserved by any short line or museum. Only time will tell what may replace the SD70 ACE.